It's that time of year. Like swallows returning to Capistrano, college students are returning to Columbia to continue their higher education. And in keeping with that spirit, we are at one of the hallowed gathering places of higher learning, Five Points. Cable Vantage is taking its cameras out to see what the college students in Columbia know. Since we're talking to students, you know this is going to be funny. Keep watching to see what happens next. Who is the Greek goddess of love, lust, and beauty? Helen of Troy? No. I'm not Greek. I'm American. <laughs> okay. I'm right. American. <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> oh, uh, Zeus? Was it Athena? Venus? Aphrodite? Correct. Oh, yeah. Hey, oh, yeah. <laughs> we all have an answer for this one. What's the worst experience you've had with a roommate? Uh, having all of my possessions, uh, to include suits, ties, every item of clothing I would ever wear, thrown out into a muddy front lawn while it's raining. Uh, we had suite mates that we shared a bathroom with, and they would take showers at like 3 o'clock in the morning. It would make us up. I had some roommates get in a pretty serious, uh, bloody fight that ended in me uh, having to find somewhere to move to abruptly. I got in a really bloody fight with the roommate and ended up having to find somewhere else to live. <laughs> that sounds familiar. Yeah, well, you know. Okay. We, we had two roommates at the time. One of them I didn't fight with, so. Okay. You can guess which one. All right. All right. <laughs> so, what class do you think is the most useless? Uh, I would have to say calculus, because there's no use for it later in life. It's just useless. Swahili. Swahili? Yes. Why? Some I'm American. <laughs> you know what? You're very patriotic. I love America. Cold beer and speaking English. Um, I took a Geography 101 class just for an elective, so I thought it would be easy. Mm -hmm. And it turned out to be really hard, and I still didn't learn anything, so. Well, in my, in my college, I would say speed reading. The most useless? Mm-hmm. Oh, man. Um, English. English is yeah. useless? Yeah. But you need it to speak to me and everybody else. Well, see, you know, it's just, he says, you know, there's nothing. Um, probably calculus because I'm really bad at it, so I think it's pretty useless. Okay. What's the most points you've ever scored in NCAA football? 74. 74? Yeah, 74. <laughs> You're talking to the wrong guy about all this stuff. God, I don't know. <laughs> 45 points. Okay. What's the most points I've ever scored? Mm -hmm. I'm just a student. I don't play or nothing. I meant the video game. The video game? Yeah. I live out in the woods. I don't know. This is the most important question you can ask a college student. Who did you take first in your fantasy football draft? LaDainian Tomlinson. Didn't do it. Didn't do it? Don't even know what it is. Okay. Owens. Owens? Yeah. Okay. Oh, I don't play fantasy football, so. <laughs> I don't know. Alrighty. My first pick in fantasy football was Tom Brady. Tom Brady? Yeah. Because he's hot? Because he's a good quarterback. <laughs> okay. YouTubers, you can get up-to-date updates on when our channel has been updated. Just click on the subscribe button. Can't believe you made me say that again. Here's our viewer question from John. Of the following items, which one can you not live without? Crokies or rainbow sandals? Rainbows. Rainbows. <laughs> Show off. <laughs> so let's go with rainbows. Can I not live without crokies? 
Rainbows. My rainbows, I love them. Can't love live them? without them. I have there one right now, are. yay. Yay, <laughs> model those <Yeah>. sandals. <laughs> Of all of your online friends, how many of them do you actually talk to in real life? Three or four, maybe? Uh, not many. <laughs> not many? No, not many. I'd say around 10, 15, probably. Probably about a 20th of my friends. A 20th. A 20th? Yeah. That's pretty exact. That's, that's a great ratio. Where did you pick that from? All up here. I don't have the, I don't have the internet. We don't want the internet. Really. Do you know what year it is? Uh, 2008. Here is a true test of honesty. Have you ever cheated on an exam? Uh, yeah, yeah. That was a little stutter in there. Yeah, well, I, <laughs> yeah, I, ha I have. I don't want to admit to it, but yeah. I Just have. one? Well, I mean a couple, but you know. Just two? Not, not very important classes. Yes. You have? Yes. What subject? How many do you want? <laughs> How many exams? I was asking what subject. Uh, every, a, lot. a lot of subjects. Okay. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. Yes. This is America. And we do cheat on exams. Um, Wait, a lot of the teachers. Yes. I speak for everyone when I say that. Most teachers say they have different forms, but they're only different colors with the same answers. I hope this doesn't affect my earlier test taking. What law of economics states the tendency for continuing application of effort or skill toward a particular project or goal to decline in effectiveness after a certain level of result has been achieved? I have no idea. No idea? <laughs> no idea. I think that might have been one of the exams that cheated on. <laughs> I don't remember. Don't no, know. I know it's not supply and demand, and that's the only one I know, so. Okay. <laughs> I, I have no idea. I don't even know what you just said. <laughs> the law of something. I remember that. The law of social D. You don't want to guess? What economic what law? In? Cheer for a good time. I don't know. Business. There's law of diminishing something. Interest or uh, diminishing? It's the law of diminishing returns. Oh, okay, there you go. <laughs> Here's a gnarly flashback question. Complete this list Michelangelo, Raphael, Donatello, and who? Aristotle. What's the, what's the lizard's name? Not lizard. Thomas Kincaid? No. Oh my gosh, I should, Leonardo. Correct. <laughs> All right, good job. Leonardo? Leonardo. Leonardo. Picasso. No. Those names are all French, it seems like. I don't know. It's the dude. Okay. I'm making a fool myself. Okay, we're all partied out here. We're gonna go crash. Don't forget to send your questions to on the street at cablevantage.com because quite frankly, our producer is running out of ideas. For our entire production crew, I'm Giovanna. We'll see you next time on the street. Here is a true test of uh, <laughs> sorry. I would pick Tom Brady because he's hot. Uh, it's, me too. <laughs> all right. She still doesn't get it. No, I don't. It's going over it's my gnarly. head. It's gnarly. Ah, gnarly. Okay. You see, you know, it's just... He says, you know, it's nothing... What? It's, nothing you don't already know? Exactly, yeah. <laughs> it's, every, every answer is right, so why does it matter? Yeah, uh, I've got right. a few more years. I'm making a fool of myself.